Hey guys, quick back Mr. Basics here. Let's talk about DNA polymerase 1 enzyme. DNA polymerase 1 was the first DNA polymerase to be discovered by Sir Arthur Kornberg in 1956. When Watson and Crick proposed the structure of DNA in 1953, they had a hypothesis that there might be an enzyme in the cell that could replicate the DNA. Arthur Kornberg did some wonderful experiments to test this hypothesis. He took DNA sample along with labeled DNTPs and added E. coli cell extract to this mixture. If the cell extract had any enzyme that could replicate the DNA, then the labeled DNTPs would get incorporated in the DNA, which can be easily detected. When he did this experiment, the hypothesis was found to be correct. With time, the counts per minute in the DNA increase, which showed that there is an enzyme in the cell that adds DNTPs in the DNA. He further purified this enzyme by various chromatography techniques and called this as DNA polymerase 1 enzyme. The DNA polymerase 1 have three major activities. Number 1, 5 prime to 3 prime DNA polymerization activity. Number 2, 5 prime to 3 prime exonuclease activity. And number 3, 3 prime to 5 prime proofreading activity. In 5 prime to 3 prime DNA polymerization activity, the polymerase adds complementary DNTPs on the template DNA. For this process, the polymerase requires a primer that can be extended in 5 prime to 3 prime direction. This process occurs in presence of magnesium ions. The hydroxyl group at 3-end loses its hydrogen and form an oxy anion. And in presence of magnesium ions, the oxy anion reacts with the alpha phosphoryl group of the DNTPs and completes the reaction. The 5 prime to 3 prime exonucleus activity means the polymerase is going to remove the nucleotides in 5 prime to 3 prime direction. This occurs when the polymerase identifies small single-stranded cuts on the DNA which are also known as NICs. The 5 prime to 3 prime exonuclease activity and the 5 prime to 3 prime polymerization activity occur simultaneously and this process is known as NIC translation. The third type of activity of DNA polymerase is 3' prime to 5' prime exonuclease activity. This activity is useful when the polymerase adds wrong nucleotides in the DNA. The 3' prime to 5' prime exonuclease activity halts the polymerase and removes the wrongly added nucleotide. This avoids mutations in the newly replicated DNA.